Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to add highlights to your Memoji on iOS 15. I did do this video on iOS 14 when it was a bit hard to actually see how to actually add highlights. It's pretty straightforward on iOS 15, but I thought I'd make this video for you guys since you guys really enjoyed the last one. So yeah, I'm just going to be sharing with you guys how to add highlights to your Memoji. Whenever I make a video using an emojis in my videos, which are these emojis that can be animated, I get a lot of questions of people asking why theirs can do that. So if your phone has Face ID, you will be able to use this feature. But phones without Face ID, which still has Touch ID, will not be able to use an emojis because the camera setup for Face ID enables you to also be able to use an emojis because it has a technology to track your face. So that means it will be available for iPhone 10s and newer iPhones apart from the SE which still has touch ID so it does not have that capability so yeah if you're wondering that is probably why you may not be able to have this feature so in order to add highlights to emoji I'm just going to go into messages here and you can see I'm, I'm in a chat so this is actually a chat to myself but yeah you're just going to go to your emoji sticker section which is this section here don't mind my missing emojis and this weird looking emoji. I think it's just a glitch with the iOS 15, so hopefully that will get fixed. But anyway, so then you're going to click on the three dots here at the top left and you're going to select edit. So all you need to do is you need to find your hairstyle section and then you can see here it says add highlights. Just click on that and then you can see all the different types of highlights. There are three and then you also have your hair colors for your highlights. So right now it is set on modern. I'm going to add a very contrasting color to my natural hair color so you can clearly see it. So this is my main tip for adding highlights to your emojis if you're using the modern or the classic which looks like this. I do recommend you use a color that's very similar to your main hair color because it will look pretty weird otherwise I feel like it doesn't look very natural or very blended in so I do recommend going with the colors pretty close to your hair color so here you can see it's a different type of brown a lighter brown but it still looks pretty natural um, opposed to having like a yellow you see so yeah that's my main tip for adding highlights so modern classic um, those are your plain highlights and then you also have gradient I think gradient's probably my favorite here you can play around with any color it doesn't really make it look strange or anything you can just go with like a light blonde or something and will still look pretty cool so yeah gradient's way easier and I feel like it looks better but yeah I know not everyone has gradient highlights so yeah that's basically all there is to adding highlights from emoji it's really easy you can also see here um at the bottom all your hairstyles and what the highlights will look on each hairstyle. I like the ones with the bangs with some of the highlights. I feel like it shows it's off really nicely. So yeah, that is how you add highlights to your emoji really quick and easy. I hope this video helped you guys figure out how to add highlights to your emoji if you didn't know. If you did enjoy this video and found it helpful, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below any other questions you might have for me. Definitely subscribe by clicking on the icon on the screen. Click on the playlist to see all of my other Memoji related videos and click on the video to my previously uploaded video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!